Hi everyone, Andy Davis here again from Master of Voice, a channel with reactions to performers from across the world. In this episode, by huge request from so many of you, I'm going to be reacting to Amora Tarno again, but this time by Rocio de Call. I was able to react to a duet of her with Juan Gabriel, and so I'm eager to hear her version of this very touching and emotional song. It's a beautiful accompaniment as well. She's looking beautiful in her green dress. Beautiful orchestra. They appreciate this song so much. Wow, I love her voice. I've only heard it in the one duet with Juan Gabriel, who was the writer of this song, and I am so thrilled to be back reacting to Rocio. I know this song, though, is, however, very emotional for so many people, and so I want to make sure that we include that reverence here in the reaction as well. But I enjoy her voice so much. Her vowels migrate back just a bit, giving us a darker sound, almost a bit of raspiness in her voice, and I enjoy it so much. Let's look at an approximate translation of the lyrics in English for just a moment. Eternal love, you are the sadness in my eyes that cry in silence for your love. I see myself in the mirror and I see in my image the time that I have suffered since your passing. I force my thoughts to forget you, because I'm always thinking about yesterday. I prefer to be asleep than awake, to forget all the pain of knowing that you are not here. Such heart-wrenching lyrics of this truly touching song. Her voice is beautiful. Wow. I love that part right there where she did a bit of a scoop up into one of the notes there in such a beautiful way. She is pouring out her soul in this song already. And I know that she was the one that made this song famous. You all have explained that to me, even though I had reacted to the Juan Gabriel version when he performed it at one of his concerts. And I enjoy them both equally already. She just has such a gorgeous tone quality to her voice though. And I love this song. The lyrics go on to say, I wish I that you were alive, that your little eyes never closed, that I was looking at them. Eternal love and unforgettable, sooner or later I will be with you to keep loving us. I have suffered so much in your absence since that day I am not happy. Even though my conscience is clear, I know I could have done more for you. 
Dark loneliness is the one that I'm living. That same loneliness of your sepulcher. You are the love in which I have the saddest memories of Acapulco. The emotions. Love those runs there. Oh, she is pouring out so many emotions, you all. I know you all have explained to me that she lost her son, I believe, to drowning in Acapulco. So the words are just so personal to her. And I just can't imagine the emotions she feels on such a personal and deep, heartbroken level when she performs this song. And the lyrics go on to repeat a bit of the chorus. I wish that you were alive, that your little eyes never closed, that I was looking at them, eternal love, and unforgettable, sooner or later I will be with you, to keep loving us, eternal love, eternal, eternal love. Such beautiful lyrics for such a beautiful and gorgeous, but heart-wrenching song. I love when she opens up into that wider, taller vowel. And now pulling back in the dynamics. Loaded up nicely into a head voice quality there for a moment. Her. She's so in the moment. Bless her heart. It's very hard for a singer to perform songs that touch them so deeply. And I know that may seem odd for so many of you that don't sing. It almost sounds like it would make you perform better, but it is sometimes hard to keep the emotions in check. I'm so impressed with her vocally though. Like I said, this is only the second time I've heard her sing. So she's just so impressive on every level. Breath control, vowel placement, the way she uses her dynamics. Softer singing, louder singing, but in the appropriate areas, being able to do all of those within one phrase. A true master of singing and is performing this song so well. I know she was star quality talent and that is so apparent through the couple of reactions I've done. I can't wait to see so many more from her.
Wow. That was a long note there. So beautifully done. Wow. I'm sure most of the audience was in tears from this. I know many of you commented on my other reaction to this song by Juan Gabriel that it just makes you cry instantly when you hear this song. And some of you weren't even able to get through the entire reaction because of the emotions you all feel. I know this is sung at a lot of memorials. It was used a lot for the memorials in the El Paso, Texas mass shooting recently and so i hope you all enjoyed this reaction to rocio singing this song it was truly beautiful i am touched and humbled for seeing it today i'm so glad i was able to see this performance and i hope you all just have a great day